Welcome back Pokefans to the Pokemon Rosen playthrough. So last episode we had to go to Harmony Woods with Leia the gym leader to clear out Team Null. Um, she was hunting down the guy who was acting as the mayor beforehand in Keytown. We ended up finding him after beating some guy called the Gravekeeper and once we finished all that we finally got our third gym badge and we kind of got left in the lurch so now we have the actual third gym badge we can actually smash rocks and I remember there being a lost rift just up from here so I want to go and see what's in the rift I've got to try and sort of remember the way there though Right, so it's not definitely not that way. I feel like it was on cycling road. No, oh, that's just the Magnemite. We don't want to go that way because it leads to a trainer. Right, where do we want to go? So if we go left, that'll take us back to Cycling Road, I think. Yep, there we go. And we want to try and avoid all of these. Although, it looks like there's a whole nother area. Oh, look, there's a dude there getting attacked by Cricketoon. Oh, doesn't look like there's actually anything down here. Maybe we've been bamboozled. Mantine and Scrope. Um, we'll go for a spark and a power gym. Manton goes down easily. It's four times a week to be fair. And you miss a play rough. Um, I'm definitely going to target that Azumarill I think. Oh, okay. I didn't think that would KO. And we get poisoned. You gotta love it. Right, spark and a power gem. He clearly didn't pay enough. Um, we should have some healing items, I believe. So we can get rid of the poison on you. And did I buy some two potions? Yes I did. And that'll do. I rode here my partner to have a swim on the falls, but how do you get there? I mean you kinda tell me because I have no idea. Luminion and Clauncher. It's a lot of Water Pokemon. Is Luminion water flying? I can't remember now. Yeah, it is. Right, out comes Lombre. And then I'm going to switch you into Kingler. Down that goes. Okay. That's random. Why would you suddenly go for a move that's not effective? It's kind of like you predicted the switch. Get all our HP back. Spark, finish it off. Couldn't you just point it up the right way?
To be honest, I don't think this actually leads anywhere. Which is a little strange. I got a zoom lens. I suppose that'll have to do. And then we just gotta try and avoid this dude. Yeah, I kind of want to find where that, how you get to these cricketoon and that. Right, we can. Ah, oh, there's the the riff that I was thinking of. A lowland graveler. Go ahead and run away from that. And we got a rare candy. And another Graveler. Oh. Ended up in a battle. Obviously we avoided all these like before. But this shouldn't be too much of a problem. Trumbeak could go down in one hit I think. And that's resisted so I don't know why you would do that. And that doesn't quite do enough. Ah, oh, diversion goes down. A little bit annoying. I think when I, if I play through this again, I'll definitely go with like Porygon or Mareep. Right, we've got Max Repel. Oh, we can just go right by you. And there's the Alolan Geodude. And we've got a TM for Thief. So what's in this rift? Oh. Okay. I'm compelled to touch it. Got a Bright Powder. Not really the best of items. Oh, this one's an encounter. Oh, it's a normal Pikachu. Crap, I didn't mean to do that. Can it live a Dire Claw though? That's the question. No, it can't. So it's a bit of a waste of a uh, Rift, really. So, uh, yeah, I don't think that was really worth going for. There's another spinner rack here. Can't go anywhere else there. Um was there anywhere else that we needed to rock smash? I don't think there was. Um, let me just check the map a second. So can we go out onto Route 7? Ham Tree Town. Shuka City. Obviously all of this is kind of out of our domain as such. So there's quite a few 
few places we haven't been. Um, let's have a look at the requests. Handy in request to Advent Grove. You know what, that was the first thing we actually got given. That's right at the beginning though, isn't it? Oh no, Advent Glades, where's Advent Grove? But the actual like whole area is massive when you look at it. But yeah, there's nowhere called Advent Grove, so I don't know whether that's a spelling mistake, maybe. But as soon as we're here, we might as well see if we can go right from here. Um, I'll just quickly heal first. But yeah, I, I don't like the fact how it just left you on a cliffhanger like that. Like, not a cliffhanger, but just left you in the lurch. Not really giving you any direction where to go. Um, let's go ahead and use the bike. So there's got to be an exit to the right, which there is here. Ah, Route 7. There's a building. Are you the first one I've seen since my wife left? Did you happen to see her outside? I enlisted the people at Crystal Clear to help keep our conservation then it's safe from those hooligans, the Vipers. I know they have the environment at heart just like us, but she disagreed when I gave them my research on reversing Rosen forms. Said she was heading off to Harmony Woods to miss their calms when she gets all rolled up. People get lost inside, don't they? I'm worried to say you're a trainer. I am absolutely not going there right now. Okay, so that's definitely not the way we need to go. Oh, look at the Tyrantrum, that looks pretty cool. Oh. Well, we can't go that way. So it looks like it's not that way. Um, the only thing I can think of is going back through Key Town, maybe. Yeah, I'll um, skip to when we're back at Key Town. Okay, so we're back in Key Town. Um, maybe there's something in the mine or through here. Where's this? Rumble Cave left for Key Town. Have we been here before? I'm not 100% sure whether we have, you know. No, because that's just taken us up along 22 and 23. Don't think that's the way we want to go. Um, where's the mayor's house? That was how you got into the cave, weren't it? So if we go in here, oh, because it did say something about getting a third gym badge. Straight to business. Though the mine is close to the public, the powers that be insisted that the miners be allowed to resume their work. There are two small hitches. One, a pack of gluttons known as Melton have moved in and started devouring the valuable ore. A powerful colossal has filled the vacuum left by the Quidilly. Okay. So we gotta go and deal with that. But well, that shouldn't be too bad. 
Oh, I don't remember there being rocks here. So is this the first one we got to deal with? No, you can't just run. Mm, just got some minimizer. It's not that big of a problem unless you miss. Thankfully, Thunder Wave doesn't work. And we miss again. Literally minimized once. Oh my god, what is going on? Finally. I don't know how many Meltan there actually is. Oh, encounters. Ah, eh, Slugma. Let's go ahead and check if there's encounters that we've missed. So there is actually one Rock Smash. So hopefully we get to see what that is. Although not every rock's given an encounter. Okay, there's another Meltan. This one's an encounter as well. Yeah, Riley Curly, we've already seen them before. Right, let's take this one out there. Oh, it's the same thing. I swear to God, if we miss again. There we go. Um, we'll go this way first. So I think this was where the... What's it called? Gridilly was originally. Or was it? I can't remember now, actually. We're going to have to check it everywhere anyway for the... Um Oh, got some happy candy for the Meltan. There's a Meltan down here, though. All right, same again, just spark. Thankfully, it doesn't go for a minimize. Okay, we've got an encounter off this one. Slugma. Right, let's head through here. Oh. That's not where I was expecting to come out. So where does this bring us to? Right, run away from this again. Oh, there's an actual ladder. This is another Melton, isn't it? Yep. So go ahead and spark that one. Oh, we just took that one out straight. Perfect. This must be a really hard, hard to find encounter. Because we've probably done about nearly 10 now. And all we keep getting is Slugma and Carl Carl or whatever it's called. No, Broly Cody, that's it. There's another Broly Cody. Okay, yeah, I think it's the middle one then that we need for the Colossal.
So yeah, so if we go left here, it should be the right way. If I remember right. Obviously there weren't all these rocks to smash though when we came down before. But there's another Maltone that we can take out. Mm, couldn't just stay down. I can give a dive floor then. I'll take that. More Meltan, there's just so many of them. That one goes down in one hit, perfect. Is this the right room? Yes it is. Colossal looks like it's going to stand its ground. Crystal behind it. It's reacting to the Colossal. The Colossal is changing form, it's gigantic, oh so it's a G-Max. Kind of makes sense, doesn't it? It is actually quite... It's level 50. What the hell? Let's just hit it with a spark, see how much damage it does. Not much. Um, okay, Quilava. I'm going to go for a Magnitude. 8, that should do decent damage. That's definitely KO'd. Um, let's go Devotion. Power Gem. That does a good chunk actually. Jesus, that body press just wrecks. Alright, Kingler. Liquidation. And that does enough damage. Thank God for that. It's back to its normal self and it looks like it wants me to have something. You got a strange stone. Odd gemstone that thrums with a curious energy. An expert may be able to identify it. And we can heal up with that. Right, so now we need to go the other way that we just came. See if there's any more Meltan down there. Roly coly. So it was down here and then go through the left one. Left cave entrance, I think it was. Still haven't found this other encounter. It's kind of getting on my nerves now. Nope, still not found it. Right, so if we head down here, and there should be two cave entrances. Yeah, that's the one. Oh, what's going on here? We'll eliminate any danger to you by blocking the, this pathway. Team Null is only acting in your best interest, so we ask you to go back the way you came. You're not going to listen, are you? This boy's safe under our care. You will be safe out of our sight. Then I'm afraid I have Team Null will need to coerce you. I was going to say, like, why won't he let us battle him? Because he clearly looks like Team Null. Corvi Squire and Eradicate. Right, we'll go ahead and spark the Eradicate. Power Gym, Corvus Squire. 
We should have done this some ages ago. Now I look at it. Level's quite low. Do you think this defeat makes any difference to us? We got to inform you that, that was a bad decision. The kid can go, but his Pokemon's coming with me. Oh, he just stole it. I just want to go home. I kind of feel sorry for that kid. Um. Okay, that's definitely somewhere else. And whoa, it is right red. So we'll go back, claim our reward for getting rid of the Pokemon for him. And then I'm going to head back that way. See where that actually leads to. Yeah, I've, I've sort of give up on this. This other encounter. Like, it's got to have like a 1% chance. Kind of makes it a bit tedious as well, getting through this place, because you've got to just smash rocks every couple of steps. Here we go, another encounter. And Slugma. To be fair, I'm just going to fast forward to when we actually get out of here. Oh my god, we actually found it and it's a Rosen for. Um, okay, I don't want to knock this out. It actually looks pretty cool. Like, colour-wise. Is it still Bug Rock? If that would have crit and knocked that out, I'd have been so mad. Them twin needles are doing a good chunk of damage. Um, let's throw a golden ball. Golden ball kind of suits the colour, I think. So let's see what typing it is. Oh, it's a bug fairy. Dwebble stays deep on the ground until it has collected enough gold to form its shell. It will steal its trainer's winnings to supplement its bling. Well, it better not be trying to steal our money, let's put it that way. But, um, yeah, I'll, um... To be fair, I think we're actually pretty much there. Yeah, I think, yeah, once we get through here and up that ladder, that should be it. Yeah, I think, what did it take, like 25 encounters to find that Dwebble? Definitely a low spawn rate. But yeah, here we are. To be talk to you. Jim Lee Delayer, she's quite formidable, as you see. This town was saved because of her intervention. Her intuition revealed the mayor for what he truly was. She realised the machines designed to call the town were only emphasising the heat. Shutting them down showed that man's betrayal. For now, the purple woman assisted while she... We researched what was done using Rosen forms here. Okay. From reports the miners have given, all targets have been removed. You may just be a competent trainer after all. He attacked this as a reward. A serious mint. That's a subject to study across Elysia right now. An invasive species from Galar that seems to influence Pokemon's nature. Okay, that really wasn't worth it. So um, I suppose I'll fast forward to where we in that cave that was like pitch black. I'm not gonna lie, but getting through that cave with all them rocks is incredibly annoying. Um, so we should have something that brightens caves up. There we go. And let's see where this leads to. What's up here? Um, I can't really be bothered to fight them, to be honest. I feel like this is going to have a hidden item. What Pokemon come from the Rock Smash? Ah, Sandshrews. Could have used a Sand Slash ages ago. But, uh, no, there's nothing actually there. Um, Alright, where is this actually taking us to? Ah, Route 3. Uh, 
Um, we've been in, in that rift. Okay, we need to figure out how to actually get round here. So let's use this again. Don't necessarily need to smash these rocks. I'll smash that though, see what the item is. A heavy ball. Right, and this brings us to. Okay, yeah, so we've been through there. Let's go back through this one. I hate that you have to keep using this. Oh. Let's see what this item is. Another sand shrew. Go ahead and run away. Is there any more encounters for that? Oh yeah, there's two. Interesting. Oh, I got TM for Baldos, that's actually really good. There's a Diglett. Oh, is that another one of them things where you have to chase it round? Right, this brings us out here. I feel like this one is going to be somewhere useful because that's an Alolan Muk. Oh, it's a triple as well. Okay then. Um, spark the middle one. Reflect. Um, yeah, whatever the middle one. And Sirocco Wind. Well, that should go down. Oh no, it survived. Oh, you just boosted Toxicity's attack. And you've got Minimize. Right, we'll spark that one. Power Gem, you, and Sirocco Wind. Okay, that gets rid of the Mock, which is the main threat. Spark takes you out in one hit. And Grimer goes down as well. So that was actually quite easy. What's in here? Ominous energy. Oh, it's you again. Thank goodness I've been trapped in this cave for Arceus knows how long. After I gave you all the components for the Slime Sonic Plus, so I went about making another. Okay. I don't know how I feel about going through here. Mm, no, you know what? I'm going to leave that for now. That seems like it's a dead end. What about this cave? Okay, um, I'm not going to lie, these tunnels are massive. Where does this actually lead to? Like, there's literally nothing in here. Um, something about an uproar. Oh, he must be to teach the move. Okay, this is a different area that I haven't been to yet.
Oh, uh, you're gonna battle us. I thought he's just an NPC. Pikachu and Crustle. Oh my god, that Crustle looks amazing. It looks like the crab out of what's it called? Um Oh, what's it called? Moana. The one with the rocking. Obviously we know it's Bug Fairy as well. And Crustle goes for an iron defence. Right, so we'll switch the attacks around this time. Pikachu goes down. Crustle should go down. And a Wimpod. And Ivasaur. Okay, um. Go that way. At least Diaplaw's neutral. Wimpod's gone. Mm, get off a leech seed, bit annoying. Especially if you go for a flat now. And Power Gem finishes it off. Not bad then, not bad. Right then, let's see what's down here. Stop. Oh, it's that mad person. Yo, why are you always in my way? I took out Null in Key Town, but no one is talking about that. I burnt them out of their hole in Je Jebuka Town. I'm just an arsonist. Everyone is just burning with passion about what Maria did in Rindo, what Leia has done here. I feel like I've been left smouldering in your wake, but I will never burn out. Okay, so we must be going the right way because this is a sort of rival battle. I mean, it only took us like over half an hour to actually find it, but oh well. Um, okay, this is not going to be too bad actually. And spark you, power gem you. Yep, that takes care of you. Credily does actually tank that quite well though. Oh, that's not good. Out comes Arcanine. Um, I suppose we'll Spark and Power Gem. Do not flinch, do not flinch. To be fair, we should have nuzzled. Ah, oh, power gem, the wrong thing. It's not the end of the world, though. I mean, that Arcanine hits like a truck. Um, I'm just trying to think. Yeah, we'll go Quilava. And Ledian. Does Ledian outspeed an Arcanine is the question. I'm going to go for Magnitude, Power Up Punch, you heal up, absolute scumbag. What? What's Tenacity do? And it actually lives. Power up punch the Quiddily then. That's gonna KO. Oh my god, that is annoying. I think we're gonna have to reset. That Arcanine's just ridiculously strong. Oh, we'll go for a liquidation. And I suppose a bullet seed on Quidilly. Yep, didn't stand a chance. Definitely a reset job. Okay then, so let's try this again. So the, the beginning part kind of went to plan. 
Um, we want to spark you, power gem you. We just need to slow the Arcanine down so it can't spam its rock slides. Oh, we don't mind that too much. So if we nuzzle the Arcanine, power gem the Cradilly. There we go. Cradilly goes down, so that should now get rid of that terrain, I think. Out comes Armor Rouge. Um, okay, same again. Spark. Power Gem Arcanine. Probably should have nuzzled Armor Rouge, really. Why did it go into that and not Toxtricity? That don't make sense. Um, Alright, we'll go Kingler. I'm going to nuzzle the Armor Rouge, Liquidation, the Arcanine. Yeah, I had a feeling you'd heal. Let's see how much this Liquidation does. Just one shot's perfect. Oh, we've got no special defense, have we? I forgot about that. Out comes Flareon. Which I'm pretty sure is Fire Steel. So I'm going to go ahead and Spark. Power Up Punch as well. Rock Riot. Okay, I didn't expect that. Um, we can now bring in Quill Lava though. And go for a Magnitude. Power Up Punch again. That should KO. Armourage took that like a champ. Mm, yeah, that gets rid of Ledium. Man, this is a tough battle. Alright, Ludicolo. I can't really magnitude though. I'm going to have to Accelerock. Hope Strain. Mm. I suppose Radio Charge is Stab. Oh, you've got an Ultra Potion. That is incredibly annoying. Do our Dragon Dance. Just, just get paralyzed one time, Armourage. Just one time, that's all I'm asking. Perfect. Right then. I'm gonna go ahead and flame wheel you and radio charge you. And now it should just be a two on one. I don't understand why these battles are so hard. Let's go for a bullet seed. That's a crit as well. Look how little damage that is doing. Oh, that's not good. Surely we can take out a Porygon too. Hit. Oh, literally one more. It's got recover. Okay, let's see how much radio charge does. Just eight hits. If we hit three times, we should take it out. Oh my god, finally. He 
You think you've extinguished me? I hope so. Y you know what? It's not even you that burns me up. I'm just so frustrated that no matter what, be it me or someone else, that Noel's name isn't what's in the press. No one is talking about them. Why? Why? They're causing so much harm to Pokemon. Ugh. I'll make everyone see. Me, I'll do it. I'll follow them off to Central Alicia. Did you hear me? I'm the one who's going to bring the heat. This isn't your story. Ah, oh, thank God we can heal. That'll do nicely. No, I didn't mean to. What's going on here? Just let me out. There we go. Well, I've got an ultra potion. Um, what's in here? Ahoy there, the name's Captain Swell and sadly be my game. Wait a Saphir in second. Your Pokeaxe, good to see you again. I was talking to Oak just the other day about the determination in your eyes. And look at you now. Ahem, back to business. I'm operating the cruise liner SS Oceanic, a travelling vessel that stops off at several key ports all around Alicia. Right now we're off to Shuka City, but oh, do you have a ticket? Okay, we need to somehow get a ticket. Can we talk to anyone? Do I know you? Hmm, no, it doesn't matter. Having seen any rare Pokemon, perhaps one of the only ones left in Alicia. Um, yeah, we don't have the money. I wonder what the rare item is. I mean the rare Pokemon. Tickets are all sold out, it's just the common folk that miss out, you know. The ones who can't cross the route alone. Boarding the boat, I'm boarding the boat, I'm boarding the boat. Uh, no, I'm not gonna battle you. Oh, hey there, bestie. Fancy seeing you here. What a totally random occurrence. Yup, not planned or staged at all. It's really been a while, huh? When was it? Rindo City. Oh, yes. What a mess I left you in. Such fun. You enjoyed yourself, right? I'm sure you did. Odd that I didn't hear anything about your involvement, though. Did you bail on Maria? That's not fitting for a valiant hero, hero at all. I shall strike you down here and now, villain. Eh, not worth it. I don't duel with villains. Heroes are all to my taste. You do you, pal. I feel like in all my enthusiasm, I'm forgetting something. Hmm, was it that some sleepyhead was found dozing appearance unexplained in Enigma Town? Eh? Well, was it that suspicious man in grey have been seen boarding the ferry? No. Was it that a man named Janitor has been elected to the Elysian Council? No, why would you care about that? Wait. That was it. The most esteemed grandpa of the Pokedex has requested that you join him in Advent Glade. Hard to get to, no. Such a problem, not my problem. Boo you, loser. I could sense your puppy dog eyes watering up on my third step away. Look, fine. I'll do you a solid. It's now or never, so I won't give you a choice, so you can make the wrong one onwards, villain. You could have been a bit less seasick, amigo. Even my Pokemon won't be able to burn smell this off. Gross, you're gross, but you're my gross. Totes love you. That said, get out of my sight, or don't, but do. Oak is waiting in his lab. Oh yeah, in Enigma Town, it's changed a bit. Not much looks the same, but the people here are uh, less creepy, or maybe more so. Depends on how you feel about lab assistance, really. Oh yeah, this is back where we um, had to get the boat before. Alright, well, I'm going to end the episode here. Next episode, we will continue to Professor Oak and see where that goes from there. Thank you everyone for watching and hope to see you all next time.